maple glazed roasted Brussels sprouts. Okay. Pomegranates. Pomegranate seeds and toasted hazelnuts. Is it electric enough? <laughs> is, it, is it sweet enough? Yeah. <laughs> I think this meets all the criteria. I think so. Okay. You know, our last album is a, is a cabbage and pomegranate themed. Our really good friend, Ari. That's really funny. Um, we basically just asked him, you know, if we, he knows what we're all about. We told him to, to just like, you know, use creativity to make some artwork. And that's what he came up with, like cabbage and pomegranate and like little people. Basically, a recipe is based on the fact that Ari decided to paint pomegranate and cabbage. <laughs> I mean, I used to hang around the kitchen a lot with yeah. my mom, you know, like hanging on pots and pans actually. That's where I started playing drums. Oh, it's preheated to 350 okay. uh, for some nuts toasting. I actually really love hazelnuts, especially when they're toasted. I feel like of all the nuts, yeah. hazelnuts are most improved by toasting. It smells really nice. Yeah, right? You just cut them like that, like right yeah. stem, and then take out the excess leaves. Okay. They always tell people that cooking school never cook in the dark. <laughs> you know, you hurt yourself. Now they're slightly brown on the outside, the skins are starting to crack. At that point, put them in the kitchen towel, let them steam in the towel for about a minute until the steam allow the uh, skin to loosen up and then at that point you can rub them together so the skins come off. We just made whisper cooking. Pomegranate whisper. I was like really like mesmerized by like his vibe. 
Oh my god, this guy is so good at music. Once I heard you play, I like wanted to play the time. And that's what happened. Same way when I met Mike. James makes good food. It's as simple as that. It's almost like natural gumshoes. It's crunchy and squishy. Heated blankets are good. I love cooking too.